Welcome friends to Money and Pasta, the video channel for fast and easy pasta. Today we will make a tasty plate of spaghetti carbonara in just a few minutes, a beloved dish from Lazio yet from uncertain and debated origins. The best supposition is that the dish was born at the end of the Second World War based on the combination of stars and stripes, namely the bacon and eggs, known food habit of our allies, spread in Rome right after its release in 1944. Instead, someone suggested that the recipe was invented by the old charcoal burners. Romans that spent much time in the woods to make charcoal were organized with easily available and long-term storable ingredients. Still, others recognize the origin of carbonara as a part of the popular Neapolitan cuisine, because some traces of this dish and the similar creaming techniques of the pasta have been present in the Neapolitan tradition since the 19th century. But let's get back to us now. We'll put water on the heat right away and see what we need to prepare two servings of delicious spaghetti carbonara. Three tablespoons of Italian extra virgin olive oil. 80 grams of bacon, preferably cut into chunks. Three whole eggs. If you'd like, a finely chopped clove of garlic. 100 grams of Pecorino Romano cheese. Salt and pepper to taste. And 160 grams of uncooked spaghetti. Now we're ready to start the preparation of the sauce. We'll need a medium-sized bowl and a whisk. We'll break the three eggs into the bowl and add two-thirds of the Pecorino Romano cheese. Add a pinch of salt and plenty of pepper. Now we need to work the compound quickly until it's homogenous. Now we'll need a fairly large pan, pour in some olive oil, add the optional clove of garlic, and turn on the heat. As soon as the water boils, we'll throw in our 160 grams of spaghetti. As soon as the garlic in the pan is gilding, we'll add the bacon. We'll let this saute over high heat for about 5 minutes and wait until the pasta is cooked. Time we'll prepare a serving dish and add the basil as decoration. Once the spaghetti is cooked, we'll saute it in the pan with the bacon for a few seconds and, very importantly, turn off the flame. Now we'll add the eggs and the cheese to the compound and mix rather quickly. We'll take a spoon and a fork and make a nice nest of pasta. And here's our carbonara. Happy cooking and enjoy your meal!